Right, so on day five, mental health countdown to Christmas. And what I'm gonna say here is avoid too many commitments. It can get quite overwhelming <laughs> and expensive if you've got to be here, there and everywhere. So select what you're doing carefully, you know, is it needed for your job, etc. So maybe they have to be done. Um, do they have to be done? That's a question you've got to ask. You, it depends on your situation. Um, going out with friends, how can you do that differently? Or can they come around to your house, you know, for a meal and a drink or eat rather than going out? Maybe that will make you feel a bit more comfortable being at home and just chilling. Yeah, so be very, very mindful of how much, how busy you're keeping yourself because we do keep ourselves quite busy and it's easy to say yes, it's hard to say no. So try and say no, practice it, come up with a reason why, explain to people, you know, people do understand it can be overwhelming. Um, maybe make a different, different date or time or do it in a different way because obviously if someone's you don't want someone to be lonely so it's also thinking about their mental health and how can you um do it in a different way so everybody's happy so but yeah it's okay to say no and the more you do it the easier it becomes so that's day number five's tip guys keep keep that mindfulness up keep that keep that schedule a little bit no have some me time sorry my dog's deciding to bark a little bit um so yes that me time prioritizing yourself prioritizing your time because it's a busy time a lot of businesses are getting crazy at this time of year so you may be really really busy yourself so just think about that as well there you go guys catch you again